Descript is a non-destructive video editor. So when you delete words, either by using the filler word removal tool, by removing words from your transcript with the delete key, it's always possible to bring them back. So one way is by using the version history. So to do that, you go to the D menu at the top, you go to file and version history. And it comes up here on the right. It shows us the date and time of the last edit. I made one one minute ago. So all I'm gonna do to restore it is hit view. And it gives me a prompt, you're viewing an old version from one minute ago to edit this project, return to the latest version. And if I click that, it's gonna bring me back to the latest version. If I want to restore this old version, all I do is click this restore button. And it gives me a warning, Descript tools, the name of your court, the name of your video will be restored from date and time. This may cause conflicts if other people are currently editing this project. So that's telling you if people are collaborating in this project that you know there might be issues there and that all other versions can still be accessed through the version history. And I'm gonna go ahead and click restore version. And the last change I made has now been restored to the previous version. The other way to bring back deleted things is by simply changing the boundaries of your clip to restore words that were cut off either by you or cut off automatically by a tool like the filler word removal or the gap removal. So Descript lets us know where something was cut off by these vertical lines on the transcript. There's two gray vertical lines that's indicating that something was cut there, the clip was cut there. And that clip is also our scene boundary on the timeline. So it starts with the word and, and you see it down here, and drag it. So that is where there's words missing at that scene boundary. So to change the scene boundary to restore words before or after that point, I put my cursor over the boundary so it becomes this little bracket and I click and I drag and you can see words are coming back. And I can move my, my mouse a little bit to the right and the brackets face the other way. I can click and drag to the left to bring those words back. And they're coming back on my transcript as well. So that is how we restore either an old version or deleted text using the timeline in our project. If you found this useful, Give this video a thumbs up. Bye.